ยีบักเลงลง Atlanta Journal Constitution Family Sprayberry Hydrata Among Marines Killed in Chattanooga ยีเลงยัดหนนีนชัดยุสับชัดยาเดวิดมาร์คิลิกซานด์ไมค์มอริสซอส The Atlanta Journal Constitution July s u b s e t who was the Corp Marine killed in Chattanooga, one of the four Marines killed in Thursday's shootings at a Navy Reserve Support Center in Chattanooga, was a graduate of Sprayberry High School in Northeast Cobb County. The Department of Defense has not yet officially released the names of the victims. But family spokesman Andy Kingery told the Atlanta Journal Constitution y e s a p y e old Skip Wells was among the dead. Wells' grieving mother and other family members did not want to talk Friday morning, he said. After graduating from Sprayberry in Yi t i n l i n g y e s a p y e Wells initially attended Georgia Southern University, where he studied history. According to his Facebook page, he went to college, Kingery said. But Felt he wasn't called to that and felt a calling to serve in the Marines. Wells got out of boot camp about a year ago, Clingery said, and was doing what Wells asked of him. We don't understand the whys. Friends of Wells flooded Facebook overnight and Friday morning with messages of shock and condolence. Heard the news and immediately went into denial. But the truth is, you are gone, and for the first time in a long time, I'm confused. I don't know how to act or feel, really. Julio Alberto p e d r o s a wrote t o m Wells' Facebook page, which is filled with photos of the young Marine. All I can think about is all the good times in high school we had. Another friend, Caleb Wheeler, wrote, "Skip Wells, it was one of the pleasures of my life to have had the chance to know you. Until the time comes when I see you again." I will forever have a void in my life that can never be filled. More than yet, but people left condolences overnight on a posting about his death on the Sprayberry High School Memorial Facebook page that chronicles the deaths of the Merita School's alumni. One friend, Yi t i n l i n g Yesup Sam Sprayberry alumnus Tony Walcott, remembered playing with Wells in the school marching band. Wells played the clarinet. Walcott the baritone. He was a really good leader. Welker told the AJC, "He was someone you could always depend on. Whenever something needed to be done, he would take charge and do it, but not in an overpowering way." The two friends last saw each other in the fall of Yi t i n l i n g Yes, up say when Wells visited the area and came to see Welker, who is now a music education student at Kennesaw State, musically inclined. Wells also was a member of the orchestra at his church where he was almost treasured. Clingery said, a neighbor of the family, James Reed, who said he'd watched Wells grow up, said he's someone whose future we thought was going to be very bright. This is quite tragic. Copyright. C. Yi t i n l i n g Yes, up in the Atlanta Journal Constitution. Atlanta. Bar. Visit the Atlanta Journal Constitution. Atlanta. At w w w a j c c o m distributed by Tribune Content Agency LLC.